right now so um we we kind of like sneaking in here right now while they sleep so um he's gonna do my makeup using whatever i give him i'm not gonna help him at all i'm not gonna tell him like what to do or what's for what i'll just let him do whatever or let him do what he thinks is the right thing to do this is basically what i have i don't wear a lot of makeup so what i have is what I use and I don't even use all of this so this is what he have to use this is what he has so using any of these on the counter um, he'll put or he'll construct some makeup on my face So, today we're gonna do the makeup for Talia. So, Talia, come, let's go over. Okay, all right, you ready? Okay, so, <laughs> all right. So, yes. Clean your cheeks. So, first of all, yes. clean the cheeks. Right. All right, that's so how you do, do it. it. So, it has a lot of uh, dandruff on their cheeks. Now, use the sponge bob and clean her forehead and all around her cheeks, lips, nose, eyes, and a few moments later, cheeks again, and then do it again, and make sure it's all clean, all not no skin, dry skins on this face. So I'm going to gather some stuff, and so this is the lip paint brush. So you just paint her lips with this pencil. Bruh. And you can use it towards the eye too, it doesn't matter sometimes. <laughs> but it's okay. Oh. And now we have this uh, gloss thingy that I'm gonna put around her cheeks. So, after you do that, you make, make sure you put the gloss thingy on that <laughs> SpongeBob again. It's called Matte. <laughs> So now you're gonna put this matte like thingy on a sponge bob and that's what I'm trying to do, trying to get all my stuff ready. So that's the sponge bob I just hold it and now pour a lot of it so she can have a lot in her face, shiny you know. And so yeah slowly you start with the right cheek and then left and then right and then go all around neck, no, not the neck, oh, sorry, nose. <laughs> and eyes forehead so it gives a shiny look i think because that's what the matte looks like shiny so that's what i'm doing make sure you go all around and even it out just like you do the painting in the house you just paint your face i mean you know i just pour some more and put on the forehead I put a lot more thicker and thicker and thicker. Yep. All right, so it's done. Now you're gonna go and choose one of the pencil. She has a lot of different kind of pencil. I don't know which one to choose from, but I'm just gonna choose one color. So I'm debating which one to choose. Okay, I chose one. So now just paint her lips as a lipstick. Go all around, all around. Make sure that there are no corners are left. And you put all around her lips. That's what the there is a saying. There is something that girls wear it and guys eat it. So that's what it is. So I am almost done. All around her lips. Make sure you lift her head up. So you can see it through. And I'm done. Now I'm debating which one to choose. So here you go. Uh, looks very confusing, but I just chose one the blue color. Blue color, I like it. 
and it looked like uh, some kind of paintbrush so I'm just gonna paint her eyebrows because it's black so it'll go with the black so her eyebrows can be thicker just like me I should have I'm debating should I make the one eyebrow as one eyebrow or two eyebrow or leave it as two because mine has one so you know I just Now use another brush and keep brushing around in every corner between around the nose, corners, all the nook holes, everything. And I'm debating which one, what else color to put. I'm just choosing every single thing she has. So now this is a sponge. Well, it's a skin or sponge. So I'm just gonna use that even out anything that's left over to match her skin tone and you must make sure you match the skin tone you know that's the most important thing so, so I'm just going around her face around her neck so it doesn't look two different color so again even it out everywhere all both sides and if you need to use some extra matte or some kind of shiny stuff just use them and put them around so it'll even it out I'm debating which one to put now she is beautiful so I don't know which one to choose and which one not so I'm still looking but I think I don't need anything else I am done looking and this is my final product oh, okay, look at all that picked up on the side of my eyes I feel like somebody out there would wear this type of makeup, so. I don't know. My lips not even the original complexion no more. This is the original color of my lips, pink. I mean, you made them black. Yeah, that's all they have. Or purple. That's not all I have. Do you ever see me wear my lips black like this? Or purple? <laughs> this is not my skin color. Mm. <laughs> okay, I guess the eyebrows. I don't know. Did you even try to shape my eyebrows? No. You shape my eyebrows? No. no, you didn't. Omg. I don't know. I give you like a a six, only because I feel like it's wearable for someone else, but not for me. I can't do makeup, but I can't do it. I don't do it like this. <laughs> this is how I usually do mine in comparison to how he did it. I just usually do like a basic light beat because I don't know how to do it, like I said. I'll give you about a good six. Let know how you guys think he did. <laughs>